back to my channel for today's video I'm gonna show you how I did this purple makeup look right here I created this look using this palette from deck of scarlet deck of scarlet is a makeup subscription service that sends you a new palette every two months and the cost of the subscription service is $29.95 in this palette it comes with three eyeshadow colors a blush, a highlighter, two lip colors, and also a uh, chubby stick lip color, which I actually don't have on my desk right now. Each palette is also in collaboration with a YouTuber. This one is in collaboration with Babs Beauty. So you can create a full makeup look with this palette, and I actually really love the makeup look I'm wearing right now, and I usually don't play around with colors very much. Uh, you guys know. I tend to stick to my neutrals, my browns, so this is kind of the first time I'm doing a purple look, and I actually really, really like it. I'll talk more about the colors in this palette as I go through the tutorial, but if you guys are interested in Deck of Scarlet and signing up for their subscription service, there is going to be a link in the description box and you can click on that and sign up. Okay, with that, let's just get on to the makeup tutorial. I'm going to start off with Smashbox's Photo Finish Primer Oil to prime my face, and for my lids, I'm using my trusty Too Faced Shadow Insurance. For today's foundation, I'm using NARS Sheer Glow in the color Poonjob. I'm using Too Faced Born This Way Naturally Radiant Concealer in the color Light Medium to highlight and conceal areas on my face, such as under my eyes, forehead, chin, and the sides of my nose. I do have some blemishes, so I'm using Makeup Forever's Full Cover Concealer to help cover those spots up. Then I'm setting my face using IT Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores Translucent Finishing Powder. I really like this finishing powder because it makes my skin look and feel really soft. I do have to use this in moderation because I have combination skin, so by the end of the day, it does start to feel really dry if I use too much of the powder. And you guys already know how I do my brows, so I won't delve into that too much, but I'll leave all the products that I use in the description box. So now we can move on to the eyes. I'm using the color Peachy Keen from the palette as my base shadow. Now I'm taking the color Making Moms from the palette with my Luxie 121 Mini Taper Brush and applying that to the outer corners of my eyes. This is my favorite color in the palette. It's a really pretty mauve and I just think it looks beautiful. To apply the color onto my monolid eyes, I first start off in the corner and then draw a rounded shape towards the center of my eyes and that's how I create more dimension. I'm also taking that mauve color and applying it to my lower lash line with this smudger brush. Next, I'm taking the purple color called Sophia. I'm going to concentrate most of the color in the very corners of my eyes and not bring it to the center so much. This is how I make sure that all my eyeshadows are blended nicely together. Now for eyeliner, I'm going to use my Dolly Wink liquid liner and also my Kat Von D liner. I don't know why, but I switch off a lot between these two when I'm drying my winged line. I never knew this about myself before, but I really do tend to tug at my eyes and I'm trying to break that habit because I know it creates sagging and wrinkles. Try not to do that when you do your own eyeliner or your own makeup. I need to get over this habit myself. I'm going to apply some falsies now. These are Ardell's Demi Wispies. I'm contouring my face with the NYX Love Contours All Palette and using the Real Techniques Contour Brush. This combo is like my contour go-to. Going back to the Deck of Scarlet palette, I'm going to use a blush color from it called Bobdy. And on my lips, I'm using the color Plump. I would describe this color as an electric pink or an electric purple. I really like this color, but if it's not your style, they also have another lip option in the palette or a chubby stick you can use. I wanted to go for a more fun and vibrant look, so I went with the Plump color. Here is the final makeup look. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this makeup tutorial. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. And if you're interested in subscribing to Deck of Scarlet or you just want more information, I will leave a link in the description box. And subscribe if you're not a subscriber already. I would be super excited if you did. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!